CBS, Atlanta, Georgia. And for the first time, it is the Monster Energy Big Three Celebrity Game. Team Flights.com against Team Weevil on CBS. And welcome, Ed Cohen with Jim Jackson, Brian Scalabrini with us as well. Hey, this should be a lot of fun. The big three always changing the game. Here we are, this city, the mecca for artists. Jimmy, should be a lot of fun. But it makes a lot of sense because Ice Cube, ultimate entertainer, understands the value of having that. It's not just about the championship game, it's about the celebrity game, getting the fans involved. This should be a great game. You talk about celebrity personality winners. Hey, we've got one of those guys, Rob Gronkowski, here in this one today in Atlanta, the captain of Team Weevil. Well, we know he has game on the gridiron. We know he can slam the Gronk slam, but can he put the ball in the basket through the pads? That's what we're going to see. He tried to dunk. He said, listen, if I didn't know, if he, if he would have known that Tom Brady had 12 days off, he would have came back and played for Tampa Bay. <laughs> How about this? Speaking of Tom Brady, PNC Bank Team Weeble roster, Chris Jackson in this game for Team Weeble is going to wear number 12. So we'll see if number 12 can connect with yep. number 87 for some big plays here today in Atlanta. Head coach of Team Weeble, you know him well, the co-founder of the Big Three, the one and only Ice Cube. Jimmy will take to the sidelines today. But you know, it makes sense for the first celebrity game for Ice Cube, the owner, the inventor, the creator, to be on the sideline on his inaugural game. So I'm glad to see him participate in that way. Teamplace.com. Hey, it must be the money. It's Nelly. Hey, listen, he better represent the Lou right. Nelly, we know what he can do behind the mic. Now, look, every rapper talking about they can hoop. So I got my eye on him. I got my eye on Gilly as well because they're always talking about how good their game is on the hardwood. So we're going to see what's up. Still playing a little baseball, a little different here with the hoops. Let's take a look at TeamPlace.com, their roster presented by PNC Burn. Bank. Oh, yes, yeah, Super Bowl champion with Denver. And, Jim, you can appreciate the size and muscle with these guys. So this is the power team versus the more finesse team outside of Gronk. I also got my eye on my, my partner in crime, Chris Haynes. <laughs> okay, because he said he got game as well. Uh-oh, Clyde to Glide. Speaking of game. A lot of game right there, partner. A lot of game. Big three commissioner, Clyde the Glide Drexler. All right, over to Scal with Gronk. All right, I'm here with Gronk. So you're the biggest, the strongest. You look like you're in the best shape. A lot of pressure to win this game. Uh, I mean, hopefully I'm in the best shape because once you get tired in basketball, you're kind of screwed because then your shot goes, disappears, your rebounding disappears. But, uh, you know, uh, we'll see how it goes. I practiced two times last week, and that was the most basketball I played in a while. So we'll give it my best shot. You play a lot of half court? Uh, I never really played half court before. I mean, that's kind of all I do when I practice. So I don't do full court. I just shoot half court. So I guess I guess so. I guess I'm prepared. Right, go out there and dominate. Don't let our commissioner I'm down. Gonna dominate, though. Let's go. Let's go. I think Gronk is ready to go Gronk on all of us here today. All right, celebrity game rules in this first ever matchup in the big three. We'll get to the break when one team scores 25 or 25 minutes are played. There's usually not a clock in the big three. We'll have a clock at a max of 50 minutes for this one. Unless the team gets to 50, you must win by two. There's no shot clock. Free throws, you get one shot for two, three, or four points. And Jim, I can't wait for some of these celebs to nah, fire bro. from four. L listen, so I, I tell you what, I think the one that's going to knock it off is Trisha Jackson. I, I watched her when she was warming up a former Globetrotter. She has range and form. Now, who takes the first shot at the beginning? Guys, I want to do some stuff, passing it around. It's going to be fun. But I want to see when it starts to get competitive, who really steps up. Chris Jackson, crowd favorite with the Harlem Globetrotters. There's Vernon Davis. They have not one but two legendary NFL tight ends. Yeah, so you know, I, back in high school, a long time ago, I did play tight end. But at, back in the day when I played, tight ends did nothing but block, basically. <laughs> so that's why I gave the game up. But these two men had an imprint not only on the National Football League, but in sports in general. I want to see them go at it on the hardwood. This should be fun here in Atlanta, Georgia. So Nelly on the floor first for his team, the captain. Uh, let's see how I see how good they know the rules. Oh, right into the basket. That was a wheel route right there that time. Gronk able to catch it on the move. Bernard Davis not used to playing defense, of course. What a start. 
That's a good matchup. Davis against Gronkowski. I want to see who the first one to try to shoot a four point shot. Uh oh, Nelly. Uh oh. Come oh. on, Nelly. Uh oh. Shoot it. No shot clock. Davis gets a look. Yeah, punched out of bounds, but Gronk, the early table setter in this one. Oh, it is, but here's the wheel route. Comes right around the corner. Catch the defense not set, and then he finishes. I'm showing a little game right there, a little touch off the glass. Oh, it's like when Gronk and Wes Welker get those short routes. That's right. Turn it into seven. Ah. Vernon Davis. Myro and Nelly. Oh, that's his power. Arrow for Nelly. Miro gets the look. Too much. See, Miro don't have, he doesn't have a bad little shot and touch. A little long right there on that one. Oh, come on. Come on. Nice look halfway down. Oh, Gilly. Come on. Let me see that jump shot. Nelly. Oh, too much. Four point shot. Vernon Davis. It's gone back to Team Weeble. Jim, you can't go home and wonder did I not try a four-point shot? Did I not leave it all out there? You love to see it. Now you got to pull one BD first one to try. No turnover. He didn't know the rule right there. BD could have just took it right up. Bumble Gronk, Nelly, no. Give me the kick. Working against Nelly. Oh. Okay. Oh. Now gets a look. Nice moves. Rock fires. Ellie didn't know the rule, too. He could have took it right back up. Davis. Rock a little bit too good there. Dilly mounts in the house. Mounts in the house. That's some Philadelphia swagger from Gilly the Kid. Wobble got here. Wobble! Avoids a double. Rock to the rim. Reverse. Got it! Rob Gronkowski. The ball is kept. Gronk got, he has, I mean, that reverse layup, okay. He got it, but a lot of guys that don't play the game don't know how to use the window, and that time Rock knew exactly what he wanted to do. Yeah, Clyde the Glide liked him. And at long last, the foul is called here on Gilly the Kid. Powerful, but yet. Nice little soft touch right there. Like Gronk, look at him. Is it anyone is it that has more fun than, than Robert? Huh? No. I, I mean, just, I want to kick it with him one day just to see what it is. See what it's like. Graceful Gronk. Yeah, his father, Gordon, uh, played at Syracuse in the late 70s, early 80s, early in Jim Beheim's tenure there. And Gronk played high school basketball in Pennsylvania. Here he is, Nelly. Four point shot on the way. Just a bit short. Wallow, 2 6 7. Gilly walking away like he didn't know. <laughs> Look at <that. laughs> I think we know now. Gilly the Kid, along with Wallow, co host of the Million Dollars Worth of Game podcast. Nelly, too much over Gronk. All right, so Jim, we both three of seven. Uh -oh. As the wait, shot's wait, good wait, again. He's walking. He's walking. <laughs> I challenged him before the game. I said, listen, man, you're on the podcast talking about how much game you got. You got to see it right now. Back to back shot. Uh oh, pick up my guy, check it in, Chris Haynes. NBA writer for Yahoo, Davis Snow. This will go out of bounds. Check it out. 
Gilly, Barlow in the corner. Look, his partner in crime. Nero doesn't get out. Come on, Chris. Chris in front of me right now. Hey, he's looking at He said he missed all the misses he had. He let it go in warm up. So that means he's not going to miss a shot. That's what he said. He's one of the first guys warming up. Step to his right. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Chris Haynes. He, he said he wants to smoke. <laughs> Jim, that was microwave esque. Oh, oh, wait. That was a side step. Okay. You notice that. Not only does he cover the league, but he pays attention and <laughs> emulates some of the moves right there. You guys don't sleep on him. He's been all the NBA games, like the media games, he dominates them. So he does. I'm, I'm telling you, man, this is this is legit. He's a, he's a yeah, he's legit. Hey, 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 but listen to him. So Chris, I you still we still gotta give him a little hazing a little bit. Look at him playing D right here. See, he knows he can get this right here. And he a real hooper. Yeah, he's a hooper. But I still got to give it. I got to make it tough for him. I told him he got to prove it. Here he is again. Against NLE oh, Chapa. Oh, Step oh, around. Oh, got it! Mr. Haynes, 11 0 team lethal run. Hey, listen. Chris A. Not just all talk, got a lot of action to his game. You're watching the Big Three Monster Energy Celebrity Game. Saturday, college football matchup out west featuring a tough, experienced defense against one of the most potent rushing attacks in the country. Colorado clashing with Air Force Saturday, 3.30 Eastern, right here on CBS. The score of the Big Three Monster Energy Celebrity Game, Team Liebel, a 13-2 lead against TeamPrice.com. Tick Pick, proud to be the official secondary ticket marketplace of the Big Three. Why pay extra for tickets when you can get the same seats for better prices on TickPick? Download the app to get the guaranteed best prices on tickets to any live event. No service fees, period. Scal with Chris Haynes. All right, a lot of people out there want you to miss shots. You came in and did your thing. Yeah, I, I'm right. Look, now, I came all from California. Yeah. I didn't come out here to play, man. Come on, man. I told Q, once you get me in, I'm going to go hard. I'm probably going to lose my breath, but I'm ready to go whenever you need me. All right, good luck the rest of the way. But I'm over here telling everybody, you dominate the media game. Okay, all right. And that plans to continue. <laughs> plans to continue. <laughs> no lack of confidence right there from my man Chris Hayes. That's the look of a guy who comes in and makes his first two shots. No, no, no. He, he was on a mission, though. Seriously. I mean, Chris is a competitor in everything he does, and he wanted to show. But not only can he break some stories, he can break some ankles, too. Chris Haynes out there. Mickey Woods getting a look as well. Uh, Chris and Jackson. Matt James looked like a receiver back in his days of Wake Forest with the steal. Here's the bachelor. Cut play, little play. James inside. Open look. The struggles continue. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, they can't find a way to get some points. Uh oh. There you go. Poked away, and Matt James there after his loss by Mickey Woods. Matt playing with the hat on, bro. Keep it real cool, real quick. Spread the floor. So, Haynes waiting in his spot. He's challenged. Chris Haynes, little jab step. Steps out, three pointer. Off the mark. Good look there against the contest. Not a side step. A little short. There's a coach in the stands. Yeah, it is. It's, it's 23 cannot score go for it tonight. This afternoon. Uh oh, Chris, stay down. NLE off the mark. Chopper. We'll get a free throw for two. 
Chris, you can't, you can't bite on the jump fake. You can't do that. All right, Jim, Italy Chop is 19. Man from Memphis, Tennessee, released his debut album just two years ago. 17 years old. A lot of music out of the Memphis 10 area. Another one in the long line of greats. Big three celebrity game. Part of championship Sunday in Atlanta. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Turns the corner, Chrissy Jackson. The Globetrotter inside bobble. The Bachelor looked down low, and the finish not there for NLE Choppa. Yeah, but Matt should have just, James should have just, oh, should have just laid it up. Made up for it that time by knocking it off of Chris Haynes. Off his leg. Wants the screen. NLE Choppa to his left, just missed. Thinking the shoe combination though for Chopper. Yes. One fluorescent fuchsia. Another the lime color. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Mickey Woods. Oh! 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 Jim, I know what you're thinking. Second effort's denied. You know what I'm thinking? Twenty dollar move. Ten dollar shot. <laughs> You already knew. Yeah. Uh -oh. James against Haynes. Oh, oh. Trouble. Yeah, Chris Haynes. He knew what happened. Watch at the end. Chop is two hands up. What is that? He pulls him right there. Oh, almost got away with it. Like the effort. Chris Jackson with Mickey Woods. Chris Haynes. Going up. Going up. Told you. Told you. <laughs> it's going to stay with Team Weeble, who has dominated here in the early going. Yeah, they've been stuck on 13 for a little while. Mm. So let's see if they can. Can kind of get that offensive spark they had a little bit early. Jimmy Allen saw it go off. He's right in front of Michael Beasley. Wants uh -oh. a four point shot. Uh -oh. Fires. Short. Short. Way short. <laughs> Got to use your legs on that one, partner. What do you think, Jim? Uh, not even. Was it online? Yes. 25 for shot, shot only 23. Wrong back in. Uh oh, Chris, let it go. Chris Jackson Ooh. putting on the moves. Ball fake. Too much. The moves have been terrific. Uh -huh. The finishes have been suspect. Chopper. Four point shot, not there. And the bachelor going to work. Jimmy Allen missed the four, but oh, strokes the three. That's nice stroke, man. Tell you, some, of these, some of these celebrities, well, they're not making shots, but they got some pretty good form in this shoot. 12 to 87. Brady's pass, not bad. Gronk couldn't haul it in. Jimmy Allen can't go back to back. Three ball. Mickey Woods. Lay it up. Air ball, don't need to clear. Set the beat. And only Choppa hits the three. Your lady making pay. Top of that time, squared up those puppies behind the line. Ice Cube needs a timeout. What a big one here from TeamPice.com. Well, listen, a little slow start early on, but now kind of find the rhythm a little bit. Again, I talked about Weeble getting stuck on 13. Nice form right there. High arc, leave it up top. 
I'll tell you, Jimmy Allen missing that four-point shot, airballing it may have been the best thing for him because he's made back-to-back -back threes. Got his legs into a little bit more. Ice Cube drawing up something in the time. Now let's see if teamable people can execute it. And Ali Chapa hitting the last three for TeamPrice.com. It's a 10-0 run. Now they haven't shot well. They're just 4-24, but the shooting struggles have really picked up for Team Weeble. Back in the game along with Wallow and Braun. Okay, nice Gilly. Gilly. Got it. Oh, and one. He wanted it. And we welcome in the captain of uh, Team Rice.com. Hey, Nelly. Hey, what's happening? Nelly, what's good, baby? It's Jimmy Jackson. What's up, brother? Oh, what's up? <laughs> what up? I see you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. How you doing? I'm hanging. Now, see, I got a seat now. You talked about you had game. Oh, and man. Come on, man. No defense at all. Come on, you got to represent the Lou over here. Yeah, I got I to gotta, I gotta make this. I got I to gotta, I gotta turn it around. Hey, Nelly, they're about to bring the fire here. Brock. Is that what that is? Against Matt James. Oh, man. What, what, that's what this is? Yeah. That's what that, oh, okay. So you can challenge oh, the foul, God. shooting foul. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't want to bring Nan Fire against Braun. <laughs> <laughs> hey, ain't, ain't, ain't you supposed to be in camp? I know, right? He talking about he don't do camp. Yeah, I don't blame said, him. Oh, man, man look at Bronx, this. I don't do oh, it my God, look at all that WWE. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. That's a tight end. Thank you, down a wide receiver. Now that's called a mismatch right yeah. there. <laughs> Look at Gilly. Don't, don't play my music for Gronk. <laughs> Who is controlling the music? Don't play my music hey, for Gronk. Hey, Nelly, it just got hot, what bro. Is this? It just got hot. Oh, my goodness. That's terrible. <laughs> that's terrible. Nelly, we got to get you out there for a bring yeah, the fire I'm, challenge I'm, I'm, next time. Oh, no, no. no I got to be on the offense again. I don't play defense. Yeah, James. Oh, oh, there you go, Chop. He's looking for a little retribution uh -oh. there against uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Ooh. It's a bucket. This a bucket. It's a bucket. This a bucket. This One a bucket. leg. You Nelly, it. you caught it. it. This a bucket. Boom, baby. Hey, hey Nelly, this what, with everything you got going on, what made you want to decide to go ahead and participate in the celebrity, <laughs> in the celebrity game? I mean, I don't know. I mean, you know, my man Polo called me, man. Right. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> uh, and he asked me would I, you know, would I participate, man? And I mean, obviously, you know, who's not a fan of Cube? I mean, you know, he's a GOAT. So, right. I mean, um, you know, you're just so proud of everything that he's been able to do in building new forms of, uh, you know, not just entertainment, but athletic entertainment. You know what I mean? I mean, we all got these athletic backgrounds, so yep. this is fun. And the thing about the big three is it, it, it it's, it's one of those situations where everybody feels like they can participate. Who don't feel like they can play three on three? You know, it's not just on a professional level, but just period. Look at that. Look at that. See? He building houses. <laughs> he build, oh, you got to go back. Now, that's a great point you made about what yeah. Cube is saying and the respect for the league and what he's trying to do. Because this, oh, get as that. you know, it's difficult. Yo, to move that town. Yeah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about that's that. That's all right. No, I don't, want nobody, I don't want nobody to get hurt. You got to move that towel. Nobody step on it. There you go. Yo. Yeah, I'm ready. Well, I'm about to go back and embarrass myself, fellas. Oh, we got Stay you. Stay tuned. We got you. Stay tuned. And now, if I make it, now I'm going to be looking for y'all to, you know, build me up. Nelly, go get him. Always a pleasure. I'll be by the table if I make a bucket. <laughs> Look out. Right. You heard it here first. The captain coming back in. Hey, this team's back in it, Jim. Tie game at 17. Clyde put him back in the game. We'll see. Nelly calling the shots. And there is the commissioner. The big three, Clyde the Blind Drexler. Jim, the handles, the playmaking, the passing, it's been really solid in the early going. I think at first, both teams may be, you know, Price.com a little nervous at the beginning. Be able to shake the jitters off and get a little bit more comfortable now. 
Apollo. Oh, Nelly with the Nelly, ball. Nelly. Going for the tie-up. There we get the jump, and the arrow says it's going to Price.com. Great D by Nelly. <laughs> he just gave you the, the short yeah, truck. This little defense. Wallow hold on to Nelly Tungle Jump on <laughs> Sets a screen. Nelly rolls. Chop it as he see it. And Nelly chop up probing. Stop and go. Nelly's waiting. Four point shot. Use your way. legs. Got to use your legs. Strong's denied, but foul by Vernon Davis. Nelly, Nelly, Nelly. All the time in the world. If you airball a four-point shot, Jim, you're going to hear it from somebody here. Well, we got somebody behind us that is determined whether it's Chris Haynes and now it's Nelly. He'll give him some work from the sideline. Oh, Nelly, fun ball. Good hands, though, by Big Three co-founder Jeff Quatnitz. Good to see Jeff in the building this afternoon. But really, he didn't catch it. It was, I think it was a young little girl right next to him that had better reflexes than Jeff. Oh, oh Gilly! See, now Gilly getting into it right now. <laughs> getting into it right now. <laughs> Gilly the kid for Team Weeble. Gone. Air ball. Nelly cleans it up. How about it? I don't know what Clyde said to his team to get him back involved, but now tied up at 19, almost halfway through the game. So, again, first team at 25, or the clock drops to 25 minutes. Halftime. Yeah, Gilly the kid is going to shoot a two point shot. Big three, you don't really don't have a clock. It's first to 25 to the break, first to 50 wins, but again, a 50 minute limit for the game. And yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, well, it just gets a smart. No smart doubt. <laughs> for a lot of different reasons <laughs> to have running clock in the celebrity game. <laughs> what do you say, Gilly? He said he'll shoot the knife from right in. I love it, man. First Monster Energy Big Three Celebrity Game at the break in a two-point game. Scow with NLE Choppa. All right, I'm here with NLE Choppa. Describe your game. Very Ja Morant-like. Huh. Oh, very Ja Morant-like. Yeah. That's a huge compliment, you know. Uh, I mean... I guess so. We both. I'm from Memphis. He played for Memphis, so I guess it's that good and grind mentality, man. Now, uh, Clyde wanted to take you out. You weren't having that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel like I feel like I gotta stay in, man. I feel good. I feel warm, nice and warm. I feel like I'm feeling good, so you now I'm trying to stay in the game for a little bit long. Not even sweating, in L.A. Chopper. Good luck, second half. Thank you, thank you, thank you. A scout just made that young man's day. Morant and N.L.E. Chopper. Halftime. Big three celebrity game here on CBS, presented by Monster Energy. And more to come after this from Atlanta. <laughs> Halftime of this one, Big Three Monster Energy celebrity game, Weeble by two over teamprice.com. Ed Cohen back with Jim Jackson. Hey, celebrity game, it's the fun, it's the unanticipated success of both sides. Rob Kronkowski, that early basket, and then the floodgates open for both. I, I think both teams are a little nervous at the beginning, outside of Gronk, who just <laughs> nerves don't even equate to that. But Chris Haynes, 
Kind of showing some game. A couple early shots. Yeah, Gilla showing some game. Chopper showing some game. So we'll see what we got going on in the second half. But Gronk got the party started right here with a nice little layup on Vernon Davis. You can't check me, but they did show off the finesse with the reverse layup. And then Chopper said he felt warm. Clyde tried to take him out the game. He said, no, he's not happy. That was an off the one foot step Curry ish from behind the three point line and letting them know Memphis 10 is in the building. Had four point attempts. Big plays. Scow with Clyde the Glide. I'm with Clyde. You have an old team and a young team. And the young team did the thing. And the yep. old team, I'm not sure about. Yeah, you put the old guys out there first while they're warm so they don't pull anything. But, but they had their own. The young guys came to the rescue. And you got to have a cavalry in a game like this. If you're going to finish this thing out, them young guys got to be out there. You and I both know it. <laughs> Question. Hey, Scout, do you still hear me? Yeah, I got you. So you were interviewing Chopper, right? I know you was, you was, weren't you pumping that like when we were at the coffee shop earlier? One of his songs? I was. You, no, you, I was tipping. I was, I was yeah. <laughs> <laughs> No, you know what? And I, he, he hit me with, at the end, he said, I'm a big fan of you, White Mamba. What? Uh, yeah, what? That's big, what? That's big oh, stuff. Big what? street cred for me. <laughs> <laughs> and L.E. Chopper stamped me. <laughs> does Scout get an MVP vote for this game? No, no he does. He does. The guy. That right there to get, to get reference for that. To get some love from Chopper is all good. The White Mamba, the legend lives on. Oh, come on, bro. You got to get behind the three point line if you're going to shoot it. Vernon Davis out there with Miro and Nelly. On the other side, Mickey Woods along with Chris Jackson and Chris Haynes. Step to his left. The three is blocked. Nelly cleaning up again. Two point game. Haynes, the fake, the drive, and the finish with the left. Haynes came to play. Donard, he's determined, bro. I'm telling you. Chris, take it serious. Oh, he's got a wrestler backing him down. Miro. Eight seconds, nine seconds. <laughs> oh, look at that screen. He just settled prison. Nelly. Oh, Vernon Davis climbing. Nelly again. Third chance for the former tight end. Shoot it, shoot it, shoot it. Oh, Time to turn our attention to. Rob Gronkowski. Hey, Gronk. What's up, guys? How you doing? Hey, we tell, hey Gronk, Jimmy Jack, let me, let me ask you a question. Describe your hoop game. Oh, uh, man, it's a ton of more of like a low, low, uh, low post game. You know, I got to work on my dribbling a little bit. If I had better <laughs> dribbles, I'd be uh, more impressed with my game. My, uh, my shooting's pretty good, typically, but that's like when you're standing still playing horse. But when you're in a game and you start getting a little dizzy because you're running around the whole time and you're really not in top shape, uh, you kind of, I kind of airballed pretty bad a couple times already. But uh, just overall, I got flashes, but just got to work on my game overall. I'll tell you what, number 12, Chris Jackson, that's a nice stroke there for Team Weeble. Oh, yes, definitely. She can dribble like no other. Uh, she's a great player, and uh, she hustles well, and uh, she's great. She's a great accent. Uh oh look at the hustle. Hey, yeah, Grump. Look at that hustle. She's great to have on her team. Listen, what have you been up to? Oh, man, last night I was hosting that mega cast for the UFC up on ESPN. Oh, yeah. Night. Yeah, let me tell you, man, uh, we were up to like 2 a.m. We hosted that for five hours last night uh, up in Orlando, then hopped on a plane this morning, flew here, now playing in this game. Uh, I'm actually headed home right after this, back up in, uh, in the Boston area, so I'm going to get to go home and just relax and get some sleep tonight, which feel nice, man. Been working all weekend. You know, I'm retired, and I freaking hosted five hours <laughs> last night. Uh, a mega cast, now I'm here playing the hoop game right off the flight, so it's going good, man. Yeah, Grunt, when you were in high school, you played basketball growing up in Pennsylvania. Do they have morning shoot-arounds? Was that your thing? I would imagine you could go at any hour. No, no, i never really done that for morning shoot-arounds. I actually typically do that now more. Like, I do a little shoot-around to get me warmed up. Oh, what a shot by my guy right there. Chris. Yeah, Chris, what a great shot. But, uh, no, man, uh, I never really worked on my game that much. I mean, it was just play football and then show up and play basketball and kind of be like the football player that was playing basketball that was just bigger and stronger than everyone. Just would get all the low post uh, rebounds and stuff and, and, and just put it back up and get, get two points every time. 
Hey, hey Grok, this time of year, football just kicking off. You miss it? Uh, no, no, man, I don't miss it, man. I wouldn't have walked away from the game if I was going to miss it, man. When you just know the time is right, you know the time is right. I went just the beast on the gridiron. The skills on the hardwood high school group, Substate New York, Williamsville North High School. Rob Gronkowski, these have to be fun days for you. Yes, they are, man. Actually, last night, man, no lie, it was my family and my uh, my brothers. My dad was there, and uh, hosting that mega cast last night for the UFC was a lot of fun. We were just sitting there, like we were back home, like on the couch watching the fights, and uh, it was just a good time, man. I really had a blast last night doing that. Uh, we, yeah, I, I mean, I didn't really get sleep last night because when I was done with it, I had the adrenaline rushing. I was wide awake. I'm like, man, this, this, is, I wish this is what I used to do when I was like 23. It was hosting mega cast at night because then it's 1 a.m. and then I would go out and I wouldn't even have to like drink or anything because I was already so fired up. That, so that's my new pre gaming is uh, working for like three hours and I'll go out. So are we going to see more of the hosting mega cast? Is that kind of what we're going to see? Uh, I'm not really sure, man. Whatever comes my way, you know. What I really like to do is actually, you know, I'm playing this game, and uh, I just started playing basketball the other day, actually warming up. And let me tell you, man, it's fun. You feel good after it. So I'm going to start practicing basketball a lot just to, you know, loosen up my body uh, and work, work on your skills. It's just fun to do it, and I like to stay in shape. So uh, playing basketball, I mean, why not? Work on my skills so that whenever games like this come around, I can jump in and just play and actually be kind of decent. 6'6", 265. Oh, Let's go back to the days in Williamsville, New York. How about the air for Brock with the Wolverines? Yes, yes. I saw so I went to Williamsville North uh, in Buffalo for uh, my freshman, sophomore, and junior year, and then I actually transferred down to Pennsylvania uh, to Woodland Hills my senior year in Pittsburgh, and uh, that was some really good football down there. Hey, actually, they're calling me in to go in to check in, so I got to go, guys. Go, go, go get them. That work, out, man. I'll see you later. <laughs> Mike Trout for the guy who can do it as well as anybody for an NFL tight end, Rob Gronkowski. Nine years with the Patriots, two with Tampa Bay. Third most receiving touchdowns all time for an NFL tight end. The top two, Antonio Gates and Tony Gonzalez, as the three is good. Jimmy Allen again strokes it. But how ironic, the top two, Antonio Gates, basketball player at Kent State. Okay, Tony Gonzalez at Cal. Yep. Hoopers. Crocs played basketball in high school. So the versatility transferred great on the football field, on the hardwood. I love it, man. We get Brock against Vernon Davis in a one-on-one -on -one matchup before this is done. That's going to be something to watch. I want to see bring the fire between those two. Yes. Time out of the floor. Team Weeble, led by Rob Minkowski. 32-28 advantage, and we'll get a little review here in this Monster Energy Big Three celebrity game. We need, need a review on this, man. Let's make a call. This should need a review. You're channeling your inner Van Gundy. Yeah, I know. Right now, right now, review should be outlaw right now in Celebrity Game. Unless it's right at the end to win it. That's it. It's just critical. Well, other than that, no. Watch this. Oh, we hit it. We hit it. This isn't your ordinary review. Well, everybody's involved in it. There's a lot of filibuster. <laughs> yeah, they got everybody in here. Hey, hey Scott. Gilly, Scott, Gilly, won't you go yeah. in there? What are we doing reviewing in a celebrity game? I'm trying to figure out if these are real referees or they work for full locker. <laughs> White ball because Q's a commissioner. That's what the call is. Q got more juice than Clyde. That's why. <laughs> Presidential power in the big three. Even Nelly couldn't seal the deal. All right. No, ownership, ownership has his privileges, bro. <laughs> Top of the line. Gilly the kid, hard hedge by James. Oh, James out on him. Shuffling the puppy zone. Oh, he knocked it away. You gotta, gotta work, you gotta tighten up that handle, Gilly. Almost took out JYD, the junkyard dog. Now James sliding his feet right at the end, pokes it away. Each 
just has to work a little bit on the handle. Well, he said it. He said it. About the touch. Jimmy Allen again. Knocks down another Jimmy Allen a jump right now. Jimmy Allen making it stick here in Atlanta. Jimmy said, not only do I want to win the game, I'm going to be MVP. He's got nine points. Yeah. Oh. Oh, the save, but right to Gilly the Kid. Oh, I like it. Nikki Woods, nice cut. The Puerto Rican hip hop artist, three times platinum game. single. He got some game. And Stamos clear. Allen blocked. Good effort by James. Cleaned up by Woods. He wants the three. Wow. He's got it. What do you say, Mickey Woods? Nah, hip hop. Puerto Rican style. He says, not only can I drop the mic, I can set my feet from behind the three-point line, square it up, let it go, but take all three of those. Get an up close and personal look at what it takes to break home a title. Big three championship inside the fire puts an exclamation point on the 22 season here on CBS. Score this Monster Energy Big Three Celebrity Game. Team Weevil 37, Team Price.com 31. Tick pick out to be the official secondary ticket marketplace of the Big Three. Why pay extra for tickets when you can get the same seats for better prices on Tick Pick? Download the app to get the guaranteed best prices on tickets to any live event. No service fees, period. Ed Cohen, Jim Jackson, Brian Scalabrini for this first ever Big Three Celebrity Game. Jim, it's been fun from the start. No, it has been. It's been, um, I mean, I just like that the guys, in, you know, participating, really have enthusiasm for it. You know, starting to play a lot harder. It's funny because you see it, at the beginning, guys just kind of get out there and play, but now when they know they want to win it and get closer to it, you see the hustle and Glock, Gronk, who knows better where the shot is coming off than the shooter, but that time he just uh, didn't clear any room. Well, we saw Krista Jackson make a big shot earlier. She joins us now. Hey, Krista. Harlem Goldrotter's fan favorite is James with the scoop and the finish. Hey, Chris, are you enjoying this? Yes, yes, yes. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? We're chilling. What's up with you? Chilling. I'm the best, you know what I'm saying? But moving for my teammates, because we have a lead right now by four, but we got to get a bigger lead. Let's hear what Gronk does, Chris. What's that? You know they're looking for Ron Gronkowski. Right, uh-huh. Woo! Couldn't handle it. No, 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 no. But he's, he's, he's killing it. Honestly, I wasn't expecting as much as, as he's given. So he's, he's killing the game, though. Hey, Chrissa, 13th female to play for the Harlem Globetrotters. What was that something that you wanted to do, or how did that actually come about? Honestly, never thought that it would ever come about. Uh -huh. <laughs> um, always, you know, dreamed of playing professionally, WNBA, playing overseas and such. And honestly, it came out of nowhere, super unexpected. Try it out. I've been doing tricks and fancy ball handling, street ball handling since I was younger, so it seemed like a fit, and it did. And it was, it was freaking awesome. Hey, Chrissa, who's your Basketball inspiration is give it a kid. That was pretty. My inspiration was actually I Iverson. My dad oh. used to call me Iversina. <laughs> I, know, I know, I know. Iversina. Yeah, it was cute. It was cute. Four point shot. He's done it. NLE Chopper. That was a big shot. Dang. Oh, only up by one, too. This is a great game. I didn't expect it to be as competitive as it is. And actually, a few guys got some game, right? Yes. Yes, a few of us, you said? Yeah, I mean, not, not, we knew you had game. Oh, okay, oh, come stop on. It. We, stop. Knew, we knew you had game, but, but you just never know in regards to the celebrity <laughs> side who else can actually play. Chris Haynes, exactly. you know, is playing. Gilly, 
Yeah. We already talked about on this, on this uh, podcast that he can play. Mm -hmm. And Chopper knocking down shots. Honestly, you really don't know what to expect when it comes to celebrity game. Some <laughs> people just come here to play. You know, they yep. practice a week or maybe the day before the game, you know, and it was the first time they touched a basketball in a long time, maybe, or ever. But I, I really think these uh, these guys came prepared and they definitely played at some point, maybe high school, you know, maybe yeah. with the JV in high school, but, you know, it's working. Hey, Kinda. Christian, you got a one-point game. There's 528 to go. Cube needs you. Put me in the game, coach. <laughs> Put me in the game, coach. I'm trying to knock him down. I, I, I had a good, a good, um, Go to the to the basket. I threw a layup up, but it was a sweet little. We we will let you go with that because I didn't. You know, the move was there, just a little bit short on the layup. I give you that. Yes, yes. Like maybe I was a little bit too excited. I was like, <laughs> yeah, I'm there. Yeah, and then I wasn't. Go get him, Christian. Thank you. Thank you so much. All right. All right, Jim. Here we go. Mickey Woods against Matt James. I like it. And Matt. Has been kind of locking up on D a little bit, but Nicky James got some moves. He got some basketball skill set. He backed it up a little bit. Oh, oh, he put the guard on him. Like, tried to do the sham guard, but it didn't work. That is awesome. We get a sham guard attempt, right? In a celebrity. He game. tried to set it up, too. And Matt James picked the pocket. 40 39 team Weeble. Jimmy Allen. It's a little short on that, but look at James. Was he a wide receiver or what? You can tell, right? You know, he's been quiet as Chris Haynes. Just see if he can, speaking of which, step up right here. Look at him, screwing up, man. Chris, you can't post up anymore, bro. Can't do that. Turnover and Allen <laughs> scores. They lead by one, teamprice.com. Jim under four minutes to go. A 50 minute clock or first to 50. And it could come, come down to the time. Gilly the kid on the attack. Oh, nice. I like it, Tris. Haynes. Good save. You can tell Gilly from Philly. Got oh, yes. Hold up, we talking about MVP. Hold up, wait a minute. Wait a minute. <laughs> Two point lead for Weeble. And Ellie Chapa one legged. Go! Oh! Wow! And okay. Ellie Chapa. He's got 17. Gilly the fake. And the finish! It's gotten real. <laughs> I love it. I love it. How about Gilly with 19? Shapa with 17 points. Look at Hayes. d up in the corner, got to play with it. So, you know, we know it's a celebrity game, right? And it's all for fun, but... This is competitive. I mean, at the end of the day, the teams want to win. They want to get a dub. And I think Clyde and Cube doing a great job of this. This unit, the units that are out there are the ones that are playing hard and making shots, and they continue to stay with them. Gilly off the flyby. Oh, uh, James has whistled. Two to play a one point game in the celebrity game. All right, so now the clock. Now, if you're up, how about this strategy? If you're up, if your team, we will say you're up, it's a minute. You just go into the stall position. No shot clock. No shot clock. And this, when it goes out, you're up, you win. Grind steps. How about the defense? And David Posner emphatically says, Grind carried it. Well, he did a little bit more than that. I mean, one, two, three, <laughs> five, <laughs> ten. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, and they let him get away with it for a while, but after a moment, it was like, Gronk, okay. Hey, to your point, final minute. I'm telling you. 
Chapa to the rim, fades, misses. Big boy rebound that time by Brog and Gilly. Start to stall. Team Rebo with the lead in the ball by one. Chris, Chris Hayes. Chris Hayes. No! Chris Hayes. Brock, that's a huge rebound. Haynes again. Oh, the oh, oh, for two. Oh, Chris. Again. Oh, no! I could, oh, for three. I could not wait. Out of bounds. It's a big call. If they lose this game, Brock is running. Timeout. Left at the rim by Chris Haynes. It's a scout. What is going on? Uh, Brian, Haynes of fatigue is kicking in, Brian. Hey, you got the NBA starter kit. You got the Damian Lillard dribble. <laughs> you got the Steph Curry step back. Go, Brian. The game not over, Brian. Hey, hey scout. Yo. Hey, listen, you got an oxygen mask over there, boy. <laughs> <laughs> they need that air. <laughs> <laughs> Over right. here. <laughs> <laughs> here we go! Last sequence. Thirteen point three seconds. Teamprice.com with the ball a chance if they use the clock well to win this celebrity game. Oh, so you got Java. Oh, Java wants it. You know, you top of one, I told you. Told you. Banker, no, two seconds. Yeah. That's it. Oh, that is it. And on. Team Weeble holds on in the celebrity oh, game. Hey, yo, Chris Haynes better be lucky to be thankful that it came down to this at the end. As if not, I was going to give it to him all year. For missing those three layups underneath inside. <laughs> Come on, Gilly, Gilly. you've Come done on, it. Gilly. I feel great, man. Good win. Shout out to our coach, man. Just great coach. But that all Philly? Did you represent Philly when you're out here? Yes, it was all Philly, man. Shout out to the other team. They played hard, but they wasn't good enough. You know, and um, somebody always told me. Second place is the first loser. So congratulations to them. <laughs> you brought it for your age. You you, you seem to, you, Chris Haynes is tired. Nelly's tired. You're not tired. No, I'm not tired. I could play another one if I had to. But you know, I'm really not used to being on the bench. So when Q put me on the bench, it was kind of an unfamiliar place. I had to get used to it for a little while. It got me cold a little out my rhythm. But once I get back in, I heat up. How about the emotions of what you went through for this game? Oh man, it's been a lot of t trash talk on social media. And um, I was prepared. You know, some talk it, some talk it, some walk. You walk. And I ran it. There you go. Phillies in the building. Go Eagles. Congratulations. I hope you got. I don't know if you get an MVP, but I think you got it. I think I should. <laughs> no question about it. <laughs> MVG. <laughs> Guys. The kid, 19 on the day, hit three three pointers. What a performance for a celebrity game in the books and what to come from the big three atlanta as we take you behind the scenes and show you what it takes to win a title in the big three championship inside the fire that's right after these messages